Good evening. This is The Race Report. I'm Craig Boddicker. Last week, the race-based organization for Latinos, known as La Raza, expelled fellow Latino George Zimmerman in order to curry favor with blacks, who they claim are also oppressed by America's racism. We here at The Race Report are standing by for an explanation of what any of this has to do with white people. <laughs> The UK Guardian published a remarkable article explaining why Finland schools are working when so many public schools in the West are not. But in over 20 paragraphs, The Guardian felt no need to mention the fact that Finland schools are nearly 90% white. <laughs> Politico.com recently published an article entitled President Obama's Camp Tries to Diversify, in which they concluded Obama's team is looking to hire more African Americans. We here at The Race Report are wondering if it's time to rethink the value of this whole diversity concept. I mean, what hope do we have of achieving it if he can't? <laughs> this week on The Faces of Racism, we'll tip our hat to a bold new article by Harry Stein that dares to expose racist public figures entitled America's Most Indecent Race Mongers. The top three on the list are, at number one, NBC's Al Sharpton. In second place, the ORP Coalition's Jesse Jackson. And finishing in a strong third place, the SPLC's Morris Dees. Thank you again, Harry Stein, for pointing out that real racists don't look like the ones on TV. <laughs> Thanks for watching The Race Report. I'm Craig Boddicker.